<laughs> okay, guys, it's r and and you know what we're here for. Jersey Shore will be filming its fourth season in Florence, Italy, showing off some famous tourist sites. For the second time in less than 24 hours, a motorist was injured when his car slid up under an 18-wheeler. And recently, a 32-year-old man from Lubbock, George James Bradley, was accused of setting his mother on fire and walking to a nearby school and holding a teacher at knife point. Yesterday, he was found guilty and charged with attempted murder and aggravated assault. And in Boston, the world's first full face transplant surgery was done on Dallas Wines from Fort Worth. That's current events. Now let's look at the announcements. The announcements. <laughs> Good morning, Pirates. It's Tuesday, May 10th, and here are today's announcements. All students' powder puff football game is 7.30, May 20th. It's only $2, so sign up. Kickball tournament benefiting the life skills class will be held this Saturday, May 14th. Registration information is in room 119, and the deadline to register is Thursday, May 12th. This past weekend, Zach Wesley, Garrett Wesley, and Sarah Eukert traveled to Austin to compete in the state speech and debate tournament. Zach Wesley received first place in the informative extemporaneous and is your state champion. Garrett Wesley brought home the bronze medal for receiving third place in persuasive extemporaneous. And Sarah Eukert was state qualifier in prose interpretation and is ranked in the top 12 in the state 3A. Also, Crandall received the top speech and debate team award in the state for 3A, a first for Crandall. Zach Wesley is also a dual state champion and ended his career with great success. We all give congratulations to the Crandall speech and debate team. Attention, all golf girls, make sure to turn in your equipment if you haven't done so. Attention Lady Pirate Track, please return track uniforms and warm-ups to Coach Yoakum immediately. Also, we are now taking orders for the Class of 2011 Senior DVD. It will feature not just the slideshow, but the graduation ceremony, plus as many senior-related videos as we can fit into. As usual, the only $20 in order forms are on the table outside Ms. Green's office. Any student interested in being part of the Pirate Crew needs to come to room 101 and pick up an application packet by this Friday. The Pirate Crew is the new and improved Flag Crew. Country Night is back again this Thursday at the Cotton Gym. JJ and Caleb Moore, Mr. Nutt, Daniel Nix, Marty Couch, and Alan Evans will be performing. This event is free with donations taken at the door for the Crandall FFA. Shows are at 7 and 8. Attention! There will be a tennis meeting this Thursday at 7.30 in the hall by the weight room. The 26th Annual Black and Gold Awards and Scholarship Presentation will be held tonight at 7 in the high school cafetorium. Attention seniors, there will be a senior meeting tomorrow around 11.10 in the cafeteria, so be ready. I'm Blake and I'm Gnarls. Have an alias day. There's quite an impressive list of people who owe fines to the library or who need to turn in books. We'll be scrolling this list of library offenders on the portal before and after Pirate TV. You may ask, what is a suitable punishment for a library offender? Waterboarding! <laughs> Public humiliation! <laughs> the wreck! You don't want to know. Just take care of your business in the library. And nobody gets hurt. Thanks for watching Pirate TV. Oh yeah!